This is Scott Becker with the Becker Private Equity and Business Podcast. Again, welcome to the podcast. Uh, Scott Becker, founder of Becker's Healthcare, founder of, of Becker's Strategy Group, also a partner at McGuire Woods. Uh, just by background, the story today is employees aren't fungible, working relationships are critical. And in, in, in this story, you know, in, employees aren't fungible, working relationships are critical, comes out of over the years watching different managers, particularly new managers, try and apply management principles to people and, and how they do so. And, and we'll give some advice here. So, so my first piece of advice is a new manager managing a team or group of people. The, the first piece of advice is to go out of your way to take time, 30, 60, 90, 120 days, 150 days, whatever the time is to sort of understand what people you have, how they work, who they work with, is it working or not working? So that's the first thing. The first period of time has to be understanding what works and what doesn't work. And, and take your theories, hold your theories for a moment, take a breath, when you try to understand what's working and not working. Then you could start to figure out, once you've figured that out, what's working and not, not working, whether you really want to break up things that are working uh, in terms of people and teams and how teams work, or whether you want to keep those largely in place and incrementally add to the team or improve the team to move resources in the right direction. And obviously, as, as much as employees aren't fungible, resources aren't unlimited. But, but the concept in starting to build teams when you take over a team and you manage a team is to start with what's working versus what's not before you make quick changes. The, the flip side is, you know, managers come in with this mindset and this mindset is particularly bad in a tough economy for hiring people. They come with the mindset of, I've got to get everything adjusted and just right on day one. And so they try and move the, the right person to the right client, to the right team, at least in their mind, the most talented person, the most important client, or whatever it might be. But, but they're lacking the understanding that people aren't fungible and working relationships are critical. So that person who works on uh, the third most important client, but that's hyper talented, might actually love working with that client. And, and so you have to sort of look at these things, not just in a, in a simple sort of optimizing type of mindset, but in a mindset of what do the working relationships look like and what's the happiness quotient to the people and then work from there. Because what you don't want to do is treat people as though they're fungible. I could just move A to C or B to the D position, whatever it might be, and not expect that you're going to have people issues, real people issues, because people aren't machines. They're not fungible. They're not machines. So the concept today is when taking over a team, when readjusting teams, that you have to first study what's working, what's not working, who works with who, how does that work, because what clients they work with, what people they work with, what teams they work with, because that's the starting point for really everything. And, and, and so the more that you uh, look at it that way and then start to build from there, the better off you are. The, the flip side is the quicker you think you need to change everything to fit your own idea of how it should be, and if your ideas may be brilliant, that's often the wrong tact. And we'll talk more about the subject because there's different things that go on, situations where teams are broken and you need that quickly. But, but the first step should always be figuring out what you have, who works with who, what's working well, and, and trying not to mess that up. Thank you for listening to the Becker Private Equity Business Podcast. Thank you very much.